What is up, my YouTube modeling family? It's Caleb from Big Al Model Works. It's been a while, guys. Um, without going into a whole lot of detail, I'll just say life happened. Um, life happened a lot. I hadn't been building. Um, I've been watching videos commenting, liking, stuff like that. Uh, if you go back and watch some of my previous videos and take the information from this one and piece it together with the information from those, you can probably figure out what happened. But anyway, uh, me and my daughter have moved twice since y'all have seen me. Uh, Finally bought a house. Real happy. Been here almost a year. Um, been spending a lot of time getting the house the way I want it. Fixing little things, changing little things, whatever. Uh, out of work right now because of this coronavirus stuff. And I thought, well, hey, let's get some model stuff out. See what I got. Unpack it maybe build something but anyway I don't have a dedicated place to build anymore not right now um, what I got right now is my home office desk um, it's pulling double duty uh, this side's got all my modeling tools and stuff that I have left in it and this side's got all the home office stuff in it uh, need to make a run to Hobby Lobby and pick up a few things before I get started but I figure while I'm out of work and even when I go back to work with my schedule it should leave some time for building so this is my plan for right now um, like I said this will be double duty desk um, supplies and everything on that one side and then I got this little guy that I can keep my kits and stuff in when I'm working on it. Uh, if you guys have watched my channel before and remember the Bushwhacker Jeep, I'm actually going to post a video probably later today with a final on that. Um, I do not have the actual model anymore. I did not make videos or anything before it left my position. But I do have some pictures. And I have made a little video on that truck deep. Um, like I said, I've been watching you guys stuff. I've been following along. I just, I hadn't had time or space or anything really well and some of my stuff was still packed up but the plan is to get back to it um you know i'm i'm going to be a mostly box stock kind of guy for now at least maybe swapping some wheels out or something nothing major just something to pass the time um if y'all hang on a second we'll go take a look at my stash So here we go guys, the old stash, like I said I have been picking up some kits or whatever here and there when I find something on a good deal, um, all of these are either sealed or open complete with the exception of the fire truck which you've already seen some videos on my channel that I need to finish and the Escalade is a parts kit that I bought because I need some pieces out of it so it's started, it's missing pieces we're not going to worry about that all the rest of these are either factory sealed or sealed inside complete I don't know what I'm going to pull out first 
I hadn't really thought about it. Um, we may try to do the fire truck first, just because that's been a lingering build. But there we go, guys. The old stash. All right. So that's pretty much all I wanted to do was get on here and say, hey, I'm still here. I'm ready to get back to building. It may be kind of slow, but I'm ready. Um, just want to let you guys know that I'm I'm still around. I've still been commenting on stuff, still been watching stuff. Uh, keep an eye on the channel, and there will be a final video of sorts posted about the Bushwhacker Jeep. It's going to be a slideshow, but I got some pretty decent pictures of it when it was done. Um, hopefully I'll be back to building here in a few days have something good for y'all as always thanks for watching